Hello, hello, hello. My name is Kevin Owasuito. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to my channel, right? Teach yourself testautomation.com. You know about you know what this channel is all about. By now, we are elevating ourselves from manual test onto test automation, right? So I am teaching myself uh, and taking myself on that journey, right? And I'm empowering myself through self-directed learning self-directed education right self-education very powerful so that's what i'm using to empower empower myself and i am trying to get you guys to come along to empower yourselves not just test it right i've long the bra the the, the 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 spectrum of all the all the domains right testing is one of the domains and you could be in another domain but you can watch my video and get empowered and try to use self-directed education and empower yourself right so we are learning um, i have taught myself how to uh, script um, the, the ui front end using serenity in web driver with java right and i'm in the process of now teaching myself how to set up a framework but i'm not certain uh, teaching myself how to set up the framework from scratch yet which i i planned to do but i'm not just yet um, i am using a ready-made framework uh, which is in Serenity BDD uh, with Selenium, Cucumber, and JUnit, right? That's what we are using, right? And yesterday, we've done all the environment environment setup, and we just explained the project structure. Just explain the project structure. So yesterday we, we looked at the pom.xml file, right? And today we are looking at the um, Serenity dot properties file right and what it's all about so the serenity those properties file is down there down here and it's at the root of the of the um, the directory right the project directory right so this is a project directory and it's at the root of the project project directory if we double click it and look into it right this is how it comes in by default right now this is where you come to change or set your properties for your project right you set your properties for your project so in here i might want to say, say, state something about uh, taking screenshots right and i'll come here to set proper uh, you know set up the properties on, on taking screenshots and um, i don't know i don't know that just yet but i'm teaching myself that right and then also in here i might want to come and stipulate something about um time timeouts right what is the length of the timeout that my tests should take before they actually time out so all here you can come and do that here as well right but the, the, the main one here is um probably the easiest one is serenity launches a, a particular browser uh, when it wants to run your test right so uh, and that default browser is firefox right so firefox but if you want to use a different browser like say chrome right you will come in here and you will also change those settings in here right so a, a simple one to do is a web driver dot driver equals to chrome right so and if you see that now when we come to run our first test right we'll, we will come back to this right and you will see that our our browser that is going to be launched for our first test will be a chrome browser right the chrome browser so there's lots more you could do with this uh, serenity dot properties uh, uh, file right and uh, we'll be seeing more of that as we go along right i don't want to keep this video very long um next video we'll be looking at um, the uh, serenity config file and what that's all about right i want to keep these videos uh, in kind of chronological and, and short uh, shorter videos right i don't want to make long videos that has everything in it right because sometimes people want to see specific things and just don't want to spend so much time uh, uh, looking through these videos and then speak out specific things so my name is kevin owasu ito i am out here to empower myself through education right and that is very powerful and i implore you to do the same right so be it in um as i say be it in it or be it in a, as a, a, a freelancer doing a, a photography or whatever you know you have to always be learning continuous learning right and personal branding personal branding right? we'll talk about personal branding and all that stuff right so my name is Kevin Owasu and thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by, okay?
Bye.